Here we go. All right. This is it, sir. It is. I suspect Havelock Martin and Lord Pendleton landed there a while ago and went into the lighthouse. Bet they did. Knowing them, they're not giving up without a fight. Why won't they be surprised when they see you? I remember hearing the Admiral and Martin talking about this place. Uh, you're no kidding. Hold up if they had to. Anybody going in has to breach the fort and the gatehouse. And there's only one way to the top. Stairs. All I can say is that it's been a Climb this rope. Maybe after all this is settled, we'll see each other again. Mm -hmm. Hold on to this magnet. Good luck, Corvo. Thank you. If anyone deserves it, you do. I mean, pretty much just me. Yeah. Give my best to Emily. After she's on the throne, she won't have time for an old man like me. Are you interested? You know, she's single. Sure, Corvo. Yeah. But somehow you managed to get through all this mess without losing sight of what really matters. For that, I respect That's you. the low chaos. The city's gonna pull Jeez. itself up, I believe. Too many good people here to let it all turn to ashes. Who are they? I'd best be going. The battlefield's no place for an old sailor like me. That time is long past. Good luck, my friend. Hey, bye. Later, bro. So I once stood on the boat to see what would happen, and you get past those rocks, and he keeps going, and you slide off. Oh. Uh -huh. Yeah. All right. So you see that it's like a tall tower. Yep. Did you see that? Are there and guards? No. There are, but not nearly as many on this version as there would be if it were high chaos. Oh, because you. Yeah. I think theoretically because they're not as worried about me because they've never seen me. Uh-oh. Do you hear that noise? It's coming yeah. for me. But I snuck in here. Like a bowels. Is it like an alarm? Or is it one of those... That alarm means that that spinning tower was about to shoot me. It was it charging up. I see. God, it's good that he doesn't look in the only direction that there's an entrance into this room. Where am I going to put him? Put him in the butt. No. no. What? What do you, what do you mean? <laughs> We're just going to set him here and hope he doesn't drown. I mean, he's fictional, so it's not really an ethical issue, but... Right. Are you going right. to take that whale oil? I am. And because there's a wall of light at two entrances. And oh, I'm taking yeah. this one. So I'm gonna pop back in here. See that tower mm -hmm. can't turn toward me. See that. And then there's a couple of pads here. We're gonna turn that off. Or, or we're gonna open it. Anyway. I'm gonna wait here. Uh huh. And then there's there's Pat's coming. There, should, there he is. Hello, Daddy. Hey Daddy. Mind if I hold on tight? Don't do that. What? <laughs> Don't use my aging drag queen voice. It's not good. I'm sorry. That's okay. It's not bad, but it's not good. Well, it's not bad. Voice. So I should keep doing it? This is weird. It's like a weird stereotype. It's like I'm not myself. Yeah, I don't... You don't normally do that. Oh, I do it when I'm playing games all the time. Oh, dude. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Charging up? Yep. That's why I snuck back here so it could forget about me. I feel like everyone on the beach should be able to hear that thing happening and go... What? Yeah. Somebody's lurking. And then see which direction it's pointing. Right. 
So you see he's got one of the music boxes. I do. You be a little careful. Boop. Gotcha. Thank goodness there's just this one guy walking around the entrance. Put him on top of that grenade. Yeah, I don't know where I'm going to put him yet. I haven't decided. Maybe over here. Don't fall into the water and don't die. Okay. I just threw him inside that rock. Fine. Totally fine. Yeah. Hmm. Here we go. I'm going to do it. Do it. Ohio's. 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 Kind of like being underwater, but different. Yeah. But that was another way I could have gotten past that. Oh, okay. Because there's a lot of ways. Oh, so you become the rat. Yeah, you possess the rat. Uh, well, I didn't... I thought maybe you, like... Your body stayed back there? Yeah. Nope. You... Your whole, your whole self. Hey, guy. He's gonna pop around here. Clutch. Who turned off the wall of light by the dock? Is that a good idea? Couldn't tell you. The whole place is turning into a I feel like you probably know it's not a good idea. Yeah. What can I do in here? Can't you do in here? I mean, lots of things. Make a souffle, I suppose. I could probably do that in here. Let's head up these stairs. And his bottle boys. That's gonna be... Oh, hi. <laughs> We're just gonna zap him. That's gonna be the name of my next band. The Bottle Street Boys? Slackjaw and the Bottle Boys. Alright, so where am I? Oh, I'm here. I know where I am. Okay. I'm just gonna pop into this control room. Drop this guy. Right here. Yeah. And then... Please don't kill me before I put Trying you to, to sleep. It. Yeah. Buddy needs a little poke. Buddy needs a little poke. You heard it here first. Yeah. I will say that King Sparrow Island's pretty hard. Like, like there's a lot of different ways to go, but it definitely like is appropriately difficult. Yeah, it's much harder on high on on high chaos though. Yeah, because there's more guards. You're saying there's more guards. They are they're angry. Yeah. I'm just gonna save that there. We're gonna. Hello. Yo. Don't look, don't look, don't look. Okay. The tanks and these damn things don't last long enough. They sure don't. You should go check on it. Morris was dragged off by the overseers for some black magic nonsense. off. No idea. Hi. Nice sideburns. And a mustache. Yeah, he's kind of my type. Sorry, mustache. <laughs> yes. Oh yes. The ele I took the elevator key. So now I don't have to think it. Like, there's all these things you can do to make the game a lot easier, and I've done a lot of them. Yeah. And I feel guilty when I'm just playing, but when I'm doing it on very hard. I don't feel nearly as guilty. Yeah.
This is kind of reminiscent of the bridge, uh, of the Caldwin Bridge mm-hmm. uh, mission. They call them missions, but like the first one, you weren't sent on a mission. Haven't been sent on a mission for the last three. Yeah. Bethesda. And then, like, down here, they've got a a place you can sneaky hide. Seems a little contrived. You think so? I'll take it. Well, I mean, it helps you. See how far up I could get. Oh, shit. Okay. I heard it charging up. Oh, I think that was just the speed. No, I think it started, but once I got a little further, it was... it was too. I was out of range. Like I need a Franco. Yeah, <laughs> I was just thinking that. So like, you don't really have to use that. You can jump on top, and there's a hole in the top of this elevator. Oh, that's weird. Thank you. I mean, it's a cool setting. Yeah. Uh. Especially if you're afraid of heights. Are you? Okay, well, don't look down. Well, that'll be up to you, won't it? Good point. Alright. What'd you say? I said, oh my god, I just looked down. I didn't. I can't. Ooh. So that guy's pissing off of the bridge, but you could hear the pee hitting something. Oh, yeah. All right, there's another guy up there, and as he normally comes down already, but he just standing there, so I'm gonna. Whoop. Nice. Get up right now. Uh oh. There's somebody else. There is. Ooh. Is he coming? He's coming, right? It's, going to be bad. it's pretty cool. <laughs> There's a guy with the white mustache, just like the guy who let me out. Yeah. Halt. Hammer time. Wait. I'm just gonna stand over here. Somebody coming? I don't think so, but I'm gonna stand over here and save it just in case. Okay. And that way I'm right before entering the last building. So he's just like rambling his thoughts on his cronies. That looks like Voldemort. He has a nose. Yeah. I haven't. I think it's Hiram. I don't really know what Voldemort is like. He don't got a nose. Oh, poor guy. Take it out on the entire country. I'm almost sorry. Our enemies have fallen. We don't actually have to do this. I'm just curious what he was going to say. Mm-hmm. Sure. And by the time she does, there we go. She's young. Emily the first could reign for 60, 70 years if she's not seen. Oh, look how much we've changed the city already. Oh, oh yes. Yeah. The golden age is coming, and no one will. Is he just talking to himself? Yeah, he's like looking at the fire. We're just gonna do this. We hadn't helped Corvo get out of prison. Corvo hadn't been so damn good at his job. We hadn't gotten greedy, afraid. Always too sure that I would have problem. Never hesitate. Too sure of what I wanted. Too sure of what I wanted to do when other men stopped to consider. So I was pleased. All right. I know Corn was coming for me just like he came for the others. Crossing the island below like it was nothing. 
The only question of how and Hey, that's me. That's you, yeah. I'm lacking a counter move. It's all fallen apart. Oh. All the steps that led us here. I feel like I should have pity on it. When I was young, I went to sea. Yeah. Took command of a ship and made aimless men into sea. Made a collective of boats into a navy. Then founded a conspiracy and almost led an empire. I don't care. No compromise. Never showed mercy. Did you think I'd fight you, Corvo? Nope. Sorry to disappoint. You see him dance? Yeah. Let's get your head out of there. Is that... That's Martin. What's back here? Nothing. Okay. I'm going to make you stand in a corner until you learn how to behave. Oh. Corvo! I knew you'd come. Thanks. Is it going to be okay now? Will I be Empress? If I were really Corvo, I would have licked her nose just then. You did it. One body was found. Yeah. Now, I have to warn you, the upcoming song is... It is, um... Upcoming. Okay. So ends the interregnum. You know. And now Emily the interregnum. the first yeah. will take her mother's throne after a season of turmoil. You will stand at her side, Corvo, guiding her young mind and protecting her from those who seek to exploit her or cause her harm. Yeah, that's right. I'm still the Empress bodyguard. You watched and listened when other men would have shouted and raged. That's me. You held back instead of striking. So it is, with the passing of the plague and Emily's ascension, comes a golden age brought about by your hand. That's me. Yeah. I'm great. Well, I mean, that's Pierre. Why? Look, there's the speechwriter guy, and there's Callista, and... Yeah. Uh... Kernow. There's oh, Samuel. Samuel behind the bar. Yeah, I think he. I think he's Mo. When your hair turns so. white and you pass from this world, Empress Emily, Emily the Wise, at the height of her power. Like there. Body down she kind of looks like Nancy Pelosi. Because you are more to her. You are well, more than the royal protector. Wait, what? Farewell, yeah. Corvo. And that and that be that. Bye. <laughs>